researchers from UC San Diego's Scripps Institution of Oceanography are in Northern California. They're sending up weather balloons to study our atmospheric river. And our Mary Lee got to go along to learn about the kind of data they are hoping to collect from this storm. I've just been alternating between those two. Adolfo Lopez and Subin Yoon's mission here in Bodega Bay is to capture data on our impressive atmospheric river. So at this point, just open up the helium. Every three hours, they're blowing up these weather balloons and attaching GPS radio sons, sending them straight into the storm. They'll give you kind of a picture of the atmosphere at the time, kind of taking a snapshot right at that time. And so we do it successively every three hours. Um, and we're going to see kind of the storm come through the area. They're measuring the magnitude and direction of the storm, collecting crucial weather data like temperature, pressure, wind, and relative humidity. So we're just going to walk this way just because we wanted to clear like all the buildings. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, you don't want it to hit anything. Like I've had balloons, like somehow it starts unwinding and it gets caught on a power line. <laughs> <laughs> Three, okay. two, one. Go. The weather balloons and GPS radio sons can measure all levels of the atmosphere up to around 80,000 feet high, providing real time weather data every second. This information is then sent to the National Weather Service. In fact, the weather data collected here is used to update and improve weather models to forecast this storm. We're doing this for a bigger cause, so it is. Yeah, it's 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 also like I'm you know, it's amazing that I can be part of it, but it's also like I'm so glad to be part of it, you know, and uh, that I feel like I'm doing something that's so relevant. So for me, it's it's, you know, just changed my whole outlook on like, you know, you think of weather and you're like, is it raining today or is it sunny today? And, and it goes so much beyond that. For Subin and Adolfo, knowing they're working to help forecast and understand atmospheric rivers that impact all of us um, gives a higher meaning so to, to what they area. do. Don't blow away, Mary Lee. All right, the UC San Diego team has also been launching weather balloons today in Marysville, about 40 miles north of Sacramento. They're hoping to study the storm's snow impact in the Sierra.